Hey guys, hey, I'm here. Sorry, I didn't mean to be late. Were you sleeping, Joe? No, I swear. I was just resting my eyes. Okay, the gang's all here. So who's playing and screen sharing? Oh, oh, me. I can do it. No, fuck's sakes. Last time Joe tried to do a playthrough, he fell asleep on the skin tone options. Well, I, I didn't want to make him too dark. And then, well, I guess things just got kind of hazy after that. What's that supposed to mean, Joe? Oh, hey, Barack. Look at you with your new color rank on Discord. I knew it was only a matter of time before you guys got some representation on the server. What the? I, I'll just do the playthrough this time, fuck's sakes. I would do it, but I got train wrecks in the back spinning for 1K each spin. Crazy stuff. Yeah, I would do it too, but I got a haircut today and this damn barber, I swear, I think he took too much off the top. Hey, Barack, don't you think your character should resemble more like yourself? Fuck's that supposed to mean, Joe? I just think it should be more realistic. Really, Joe? Realism in a game where lightning can shoot from my fingers? No, I agree with the Joester. A fantasy is only good if there's also a sprinkle of realism in between the ocean of fantasy. It makes it more believable. That's the good type of fantasy. The best. Everyone's saying it. Okay, fuck you then. Just have Joe make the character. You're one of the good ones, Barack. Oh, really, Joe? Realism? What? You can bench 315. I saw you trip on your damn bathrobe earlier trying to take a piss. We look identical. Chip in here, Donnie. Uh what do you think? The eyes, sure. The hair, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, but I think Obama's got the right thinking here, buddy. I don't think that's your body type. Let me tell you something here, son. I was lifting weights back when two pebbles were glued together using the shaft of a bamboo. Back when silver-haired John would finish using the phone booth and then Olivia would come out with the lemonade. What the fuck are you saying? Well, guys, uh, train wrecks just lost another 15K. My goodness, Corbin. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful diamond of a planet before it turned into a blue state and those liberals took over. If I had control of piloting, I would have parked us a bit closer to that tower. It's not funny, George. Wasn't funny then, isn't funny now. I agree with you there, Barry. Hey, what do you say after this? You and I go find a nice restaurant to eat dinner at. One where the two of us, regardless of our skin colors, can eat side by side together without being judged. We just got in that scot-free, huh? No TSA? Now let me tell you, I've learned my lesson with that one. Jesus, did you just see that Mexican bump into me? I think you were right about that wall there, Donnie. Watch your back, friend. And don't worry, it'll be all right. He can't kill us all. Ooh, oh, look, I have the option to flirt with her. Be careful there, Joe. Something tells me this one might have the China virus. No, no, it's okay, Donnie. I'm filled with boosters. But there, you know your task. Don't keep Spindrel waiting, slave. Holy shit. He just called Barack a slave. He can't do that. All right, I don't know, can he? Joe, go fuck yourself, and you're the one playing, not me. Oh, right. You're one of the slaves Harkin brought in on the last transport, right? Here to prove yourself to the bloodthirsty overseers? Gosh, Barry, I I'm sorry. If I knew how politically incorrect this game would be, I would have chosen something else to stream tonight, Wolfenstein or something. Jesus, Joe, you are seriously cracked at this game. Didn't think I'd ever say it, but you're kind of killing it. Just be glad we dealt with the terrorist in this cave back in 11. Otherwise, you would definitely have some more elite mobs you'd be facing right now. Oh, that's nothing, Donnie. Watch this. Watch how I crit this thing. Die, Hillary. Word is these Corbin students usually smoke death sticks on the regular to get over the stress of their trials. I can see it. Seeing as to how any of these tests could be it, their last trial, unjustly putting an end to their life while they are still in their prime. Well, let's just hope Batman won't be here to break their legs if he catches them with the Zaza. Or even worse, Kamala. Jesus, she would give these kids 25 years to life sealed in a Juntapal's tomb. That's why I'm glad it's just us boys here tonight. The squad. Right back at you, Joe. Hey, thanks again for streaming. I'm sorry for what I said at the beginning. It's still fun to watch you play while we all shoot the shit. Absolutely. We most definitely have differing opinions when it comes to the best ways of governing our nation. But at the end of the day, I'm glad we can all hop on Discord. Just chill and play some good old Star Wars. Right on, boys. I want you to know that if my trial pinned me up against any of y'all, I couldn't do it. You're my family. Fuck the Sith and the dark side. If that's the case, it's bro is first. Well said, George. It's a good night to be gaming, isn't it, Barack? It sure is, Donald. It sure is. Oh my gosh, guys. Uh, do, do you see this Darth Nihilus outfit? I'm so cool. He's my favorite Sith. No, no way. You couldn't even understand a single thing that fuck was saying.
probably was a part of Barack's Dream Act, too. Come on, dude, that's fucked up. Uh, and who knows, he could have been born on American soil. American soil? Really? That guy? I'll tell you one thing. If the TSA were up to par on Korriban, we'd definitely keep individuals like him far away from Empire soil. Tatooine or something. Well, in either case, gents, I do believe it is time for the Bama to head out. Michelle says dinner is ready, so... Oh, come on, dude. It was supposed to be game night. What the fuck? Was it because of what I said? The Tatooine thing? No, George, it wasn't because of what you said. I, I happen to agree about those type of Sith. But please don't guilt trip me, guys. I'm sorry. I'll stay up extra late tomorrow. Do you Bama promise? I give you a Barry promise. Hey, tell Michelle that uh, I wish I was there for her fried chicken. I did not say we were eating chicken, Joe, nor was it necessary to assume that it would have been fried. Well, what the fuck? What are we going to do now? Hop on fucking general chat of Heroes of the Storm and watch people just be dickheads for no reason? Calm yourself, Donald. This is my message to you, Barack. You must always be vigilant and careful of the dusk yet beaming and bright for the dawn, each day, any day as a matter of fact, could very well be the last. And as such, you have a responsibility to your wife and your children to honor them as much as you possibly can every single one of those days, until you finally feel as though you can love them no more. John, we should put you on Tatooine. 